I don't know that I'm nervous. I mean, John Morgan can certainly do what he wants. You know, he took credit for getting it on the ballot before. Maybe he did. I know he put a lot of money at it. I don't think his approach is the right way. I agree with, with a lot of the people you've talked with. Legislatively and statutorily is the way to handle it, and that's what you elect us for. Um, and, and again, so that goes back to the Charlotte's Web Bill. We felt like, by all testimony, by all the data, by all of the experts that opined on the issue, this was the right way to handle it and, and would take care of those that really needed that uh, drug in terms of their treatment. So I believe we can do get it right. I believe we've got the resources and the talent and the people that can get it right. Uh, so I don't know that, uh, you know, I don't believe anyway a statutory, I mean a constitutional amendment's the way to do it. Um, you know, I respect the fact that John Morgan has the ability to, to move that forward if he wants to. You know, if you get enough signatures on a petition drive, uh, you can put anything on the ballot. I don't feel any pressure at all by it. I, I still know that the legislature and the state of Florida is going to try to do the right thing and take care of those that need it the most. And I believe we can do it, and I believe we can do it effectively. So, no, I don't feel any pressure at all. Well, uh, you know, saying to them be patient is probably a little disingenuous because I know a lot of people are suffering. Uh, I know there's there's ways that, you know, and mechanisms now, many of those people can receive the treatment. So we're trying to get it right. I think for the state of Florida, for their benefit and for the rest of Florida, we need to get it right. So uh, we, and we will, uh, but, uh, you know, I know it's maybe a little bit, uh, maybe a little bit hard to deal with right now if you're in need and you can't get what you think you need, I would encourage them to work with their doctor and their healthcare professionals to try to try to take care of their needs, you know, immediately. And we are trying to get this thing working in the right way and the way that'll take care of uh, those that need it the most. So.